Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to make some um, meatball cabbage soup. So what's in front of me, this is the leftover that we made um, bacon cheeseburger yesterday's dinner. So this is half beef and half pork. So first thing first, I'm going to add some black pepper, okay? then salt and then we're gonna add some green onions that's all we're going to put for our meatballs okay so what I'm going to do I am going to mix this by hand okay uh, I'm gonna change this to a bigger bowl we use this Tupperware okay, okay guys so Again, we're going to mix this together. Make sure the salt, black paper, and the green onions are mixed really well. I like to put um, fresh, you know, fresh ingredients when I'm making some meatball soup. But if I'm making some meatballs, sandwiches, or spaghetti, I use all dry ingredients. Okay. Okay, so now we're going to make our meatballs. Just like this size, okay. This is fresh, we're using um, meat and um, fresh vegetables, well, cabbage, yeah. This is really good, guys, in a cold weather, rainy season or something, or you just wanna eat some soup, meatball soup. But usually I make a lot of um, soup during cold weather, which is, we are cold right now. It is April now, made of April, but we're going to have snow. Crazy, crazy in Kansas. Okay, so almost done. You can make a little bit smaller if you want to. So really it's up to you, okay? This one here. I'm gonna add a little bit more with this one. It's a little bit left. Okay. Let me wash my hand. Okay guys, in our pan, I put two tablespoons of cooking oil. So we will drop the meatballs. Okay. So we're gonna get a little bit brown with this meatball. So while we are cooking our meatballs, I'm gonna finish chopping some of the fresh ingredients.
Okay, guys, so this is done. We're gonna get this out. Okay. Okay, so next what we're going to do is we're going to add some fresh garlic, fresh onion, okay, fresh tomatoes, we're going to cook it this for a minute. Drop cabbage. Okay. Just drop all the cabbage. And we will put two, three cups of warm water. Then we add some salt. It's your own judgment how much salt you're going to put. Then we will put some black pepper. Oh, crap, I'll put this spoon of black pepper. Okay. We're gonna allow this to boil first, okay? We're gonna let it boil. So we're going to cover this so that way we can boil it faster, okay? So we're gonna wait that for a minute. It will boil, as soon as it boiled, we're gonna add, we're going to add the meatballs. Just start boiling. We're going to taste this, guys. Make sure that it's balanced. We need a little bit salt, so we need to add more salt. Just a little bit. If you add, if you want to add more um, juice, you can do that. Um, I love cabbage, so I'm, I just, it's enough soup for me, because I'm the only one to eat with this soup. Okay, so now what we're going to do, we're going to put aside, and we're going to drop our meatballs, okay? Just like that. Put in the middle. And we're going to finish cooking our meatballs, because the meatballs, it was just half cooked. We just brown the meat, so we have to make sure that our meat is cooked. Now we're gonna cover this again. We we'll cook another ten more minutes. Okay. Thank you. 
It smells so good, guys. It smells so good, and this is really good, nutritious um, dish. This is really good for just eat soup itself, or you can have eat with rice. It is so good, and it's very very healthy, very healthy. So I'm gonna put this uh, green onions on the top, okay? And then we're gonna cover this one more time. Continue cooking the meat, okay? I'm gonna close it. I'm gonna cover this again and cook another probably two more minutes. Okay, guys. So this is done. I'm going to turn. I'm going to turn off the burner or the heat, but allowing to continue cooking because the burner is still hot. Okay. So there we go. Meatball cabbage soup. It's so healthy. Now, if you're on diet like me, this would be a perfect for you. So this is my dinner tonight. Just uh, meatballs. Um, and cabbage that's what I'm going to eat tonight because I'm trying to eat light food at night so thank you thank you so much guys if you like this recipe please give me a thumbs up or comments this is a very delicious dish try this at home again uh, please subscribe my youtube channel and don't forget to press the notification so you can receive my incoming videos again thank you thank you so much may God bless you all bye bye I love you guys